हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू शिफ्टिंग ईयर्स फाइनली हमारे साथ है के टी एम की थ्री नाइन्टी एडवेंचर एस डब्ल्यू द स्पोक्ट व्हील वेरियंट विथ फुल्ली एडजस्टेबल सस्पेंशन एट द फ्रंट एंड एट द बैक सालों से एवर सिंस के टी एम लॉन्च दी थ्री नाइन्टी एडवेंचर देर वर अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल आस्किंग फॉर स्पोक्ट व्हील्स फॉर बेटर ऑफ रोड एक्सपीरियंसिस एंड ऑल्सो अ फुल्ली एडजस्टेबल सस्पेंशन सेटअप बिकॉज the bike overseas did get it but we here in india did not get that premium part now finally we have the fully loaded ktm 390 adventure sw aur is bike ki kimat hai 360880 x showroom abhi ktm aapko total char variants offer kar rahe hain is 390 adventure ke you have the base 390 adventure x then you have the standard 390 adventure and also the low seat height 390 एडवेंचर V जिनकी प्राइसिंग सेम है एंड देन यू हैव दिस द 390 एडवेंचर SW डब्ल्यू विच इज द टॉप ऑफ द लाइन थ्री नाइनटी ए डी वी योर मनी कैन बाय योर इन द इंडियन मार्केट अगर आप कोई भी एंट्री लेवल डिसेंट परफॉर्मेंस वाली एक एडवेंचर बाइक खरीदना चाहते हो दिस इज द बाइक टू पिक नाउ इसको आप कंपेयर कर सकते हो विद द रॉयल एनफील्ड हिमालयन इफ यू वॉन्ट एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो कंपेयर इट विद द बी एम डब्ल्यू जी थ्री टेन जी एस in that comparison now the kit that you get with this bike is way too superior for anyone to ignore this motorcycle very quickly hum log sabse pehle baat kar lete hain is bike ke specs ke bare mein aur features ke bare mein we will get that out of the picture and then we will focus only on the suspension department these wheels which you are getting and how this bike handles on tarmac and also when you go out off roading pricing maine aapko bata di hai this motorcycle costs 3 लाख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड एट एट्टी एक्स शोरूम इसके साथ आपको एक टी एफ टी इंस्ट्रूमेंट कॉन्सोल मिलता है यू गेट एन एल ई डी हेड लैम्प यू गेट राइड बाई वायर यू गेट राइडिंग मोड यू गेट ट्रैक्शन कंट्रोल यू गेट अप एंड डाउन क्विक शिफ्टर आपको कॉर्नरिंग ए बी एस मिल जाता है यू गेट स्विचेबल ए बी एस यू गेट स्लीपर असिस्ट क्लच एंड एन इलेक्ट्रिक पावर आउटलेट एज वेल इस मोटरसाइकिल के साथ आपको द सेम ट्राइड एंड टेस्टेड थ्री सेवेंटी थ्री सी सी लिक्विड कूल्ड फोर स्ट्रोक फोर वेल्व इंजन मिलती है विच प्रोड्यूस फोर्टी थ्री पॉइंट फाइव पी एस एट नाइन थाउजेंड आर पी एम एंड थर्टी सेवन न्यूटन मीटर ऑफ टॉर्क एट सेवन थाउजेंड आर पी एम मैच टू अक्स स्पीड गेयर बॉक्स एंड स्लीपर असिस्ट क्लच तो मैंने आपको ऑलरेडी बता दिया है वेरी क्विकली लेट्स टॉक अबाउट सम इम्पोर्टेंट नंबर इस मोटरसाइकिल का कर्व वेट है वन सेवेंटी सेवन के जी व्हील बेस है वन फोर थ्री जीरो मिलीमीटर्स ग्राउंड क्लियरेंस है दो सौ मिलीमीटर्स का साइडल हाइट है एट फिफ्टी फाइव मिलीमीटर्स यू गेट अ नाइनटीन इंच फ्रंट व्हील एंड अ सेवेंटीन इंच रियर व्हील बट दिस टाइम यू गेट अ स्पोक्ट व्हील सेटअप और ये ट्यूब्ड टाइप के व्हील्स हैं दीज आर नॉट ट्यूबलेस स्पोक व्हील्स बट दीज आर स्पोक्ट एल्यूमिनियम व्हील्स इसी के वजह से इस बाइक का वजन जो है वो चेंज नहीं हुआ है ऑल फोर वेरियंट्स ऑफ द के टी एम थ्री नाइनटी एडवेंचर वे द सेम वन सेवेंटी सेवन के जी इसके साथ आपको एक 320 ट्वेंटी मिलीमीटर फ्रंट डिस्क मिलता है 230 थर्टी मिलीमीटर रेयर डिस्क मिलता है एंड द पावर टू वेट रेशियो इज 246 फोर्टी सिक्स पी एस पर टन अब ये जो स्पोक्ट व्हील सेटअप आपको इस बाइक के साथ मिलता है के टी एम हैज नॉट स्पेसिफाइड एनी फिक्स इंटरवल जब आपने ये स्पोक्स जो है इन्हें चेक करना चाहिए इफ दे आर टाइट इनफ नाउ दैट इज वेरिएबल बिकॉज इट डिपेंड्स ऑन हाउ यू राइड योर मोटरसाइकिल वेर यू राइड योर मोटरसाइकिल हाउ मेनी टाइम्स यू गो अप एंड डाउन अ ट्रेल सो इफ यू आर टू अब्यूजिव विद दिस बाइक I would say that आपको ज्यादा frequently ये spokes जो है इन्हें check करना होगा अभी काफी owners जो है इन spoked wheels पे आउट एक्स टेप भी यूज कर सकते हैं द रिम टेप सो दैट यू कैन मेक यूज ऑफ दीज व्हील्स एज ट्यूबलेस व्हील्स ये जो टायर्स आपको इस बाइक के साथ मिल रहे हैं द मेडलर टूअर टायर्स दे आर द सेम एज द स्टैंडर्ड थ्री नाइनटी ए डी वी सो आप इन्हें ट्यूबलेस तरीके से इस्तेमाल कर सकते हो बट देन दैट आउट एक्स रिम टेप इज नॉट गोइंग टू बी अ लॉन्ग टर्म सोल्यूशन उसमें से आप टाइम एंड अगेन एयर लीक जो है उसे नोटिस कर लोगे सो दैट इज नॉट अ परमानेंट सोल्यूशन जब आप इस सेटअप को विद अ ट्यूब इस्तेमाल करोगे दिस बाइक इज गोइंग टू बी मोर वर्दी फॉर अब्यूज सो अगर आप ज्यादा हार्ड इंपैक्ट ले लेते हो अगर रिम बेंड हो जाती है तो एयर लीक नहीं होने वाली है बिकॉज यू हैव दैट ट्यूब सो दैट इज एन एडेड एडवांटेज लेकिन जब ये बाइक पंक्चर हो जाएगी जब ट्यूब पंक्चर हो जाएगी that is going to take a lot of time to fix so that is the positive and negative of this spoked wheel setup so it is up to you if you think this is good enough for you know abusive riding out on the trail or if you want that added convenience and if you would buy this variant and then fix alloy wheels 
Now those alloy wheels are going to cost you somewhere between 20 to 25,000 rupees if you want that as an aftermarket kit. So that is up to you if that is something that you prefer. Now let's talk about this motorcycle suspension setup. This is the most advanced motorcycle of its class. This kind of bike you don't get any other bike at this price range. This bike offers you the most premium kit for your money. The KTM 390 series overall did offer you the best of performance in each of its avatar. And now this 390 Adventure with this spoked wheel setup and with fully adjustable suspension at the front and at the back. This is a very versatile motorcycle for off-roading and also for all India touring. इस बाइक के साथ जो आपको 43 mm upside down open cartridge front fork दिया गया है, इसके साथ आपको 30 clicks मिलते हैं for compression adjustment and 30 clicks for rebound adjustment. जो पीछे mono shock आपको दिया गया है, you get 10 steps for preload and 20 clicks for rebound. The front suspension is going to offer you 170 mm of wheel travel and the rear will offer you 177 mm of wheel travel. Now let me tell you very clearly. अगर ये सस्पेंशन सेटअप जो है, ये जो क्लिक्स हैं यहाँ पे, इन्हें कोई आके एडजस्ट कर देता है विदाउट योर नॉलेज। इट इस नॉट गोइंग टू हर्ट योर राइडिंग एक्सपीरियंस। ऑफ कोर्स यू विल फील द डिफरेंस, बट देन द गुड थिंग इज आप ये सभी चेंजेस ऑन द गो कर सकते हो। व्हेन यू आर राइडिंग योर बा� 15-15 is the ideal ratio for rebound and compression. So after that you can move up and down depending on your weight, your riding style and where you are riding your motorcycle. Now there is no fixed description or you know a clear indicator at what setting that suspension is set at. कहीं कोई नंबर नहीं है और वो जो रोटेट करने वाले हो आप उस स्विच को you know you will have to just memorize where it is. But again, it keeps doing that for multiple times. So, it's not that where you see it, it is the same setting what it was when you previously set it. If you have children in society who fidget a lot, you will have to ensure that you keep checking that suspension setup. That is a downside. But then the good thing is, when you ride this bike, personally, I have a KTM 390 Adventure, the first lot motorcycle. I bought it after I rode this bike for the first time at the first media ride here in India. Compare that to this, the suspension is plush. Plush is the word which is something that we would never you know, use for this motorcycle, for the 390 Adventure. Now the way this bike moves over speed breakers, you will get more confidence and you will get more comfort. Every time you jump up, every time you land, you can now feel more control over the motorcycle because now you can set it as per your weight. The way you are going to land is going to give you more confidence so that you keep up, you keep continuing with your momentum. You are not going to feel scared or you know, the bike is not going to get unsettled because now the control is in your hands. Even at the back, you can adjust the preload and the rebound. You can adjust it as per your weight, as per the luggage load that you are carrying. So the suspension setup is now really much more comfortable compared to the standard 390 adventure agar aapne standard 390 adventure kafi samay tak chalai hai when you hop on to this bike and once you set the suspension to your riding style and your requirement this is going to surprisingly please you what a huge difference a suspension setup can make this is the perfect example aapne kafi logo ko koi dusre bike ka suspension is 390 adventure pe retrofit karte hue dekha hoga a company spends millions of dollars in R&D. They know best what is best for their motorcycle. Kisi Expulse ka, Himalayan ka ya G310 GS ka suspension isme laga ke, this is not going to be the ideal way forward. That is a jugaad jo kaafi log karte hai. But now you have the full kit and now you can play with your motorcycle the way you like it. Jab aap is bike ko twisty roads pe chala loge, once you have set it up, it is very confidence inspiring. You still get the super grippy Metzeler Torrance tires so you can attack corners. The suspension setup will now back you up. It will give you more confidence. And these spoked wheels, they don't interfere in your riding experience. Only off-roading, these wheels are more durable. So that is a positive. But out on tarmac, this is not going to trouble you at all. This will not interfere with your riding experience at all. Now I'm sure you want to check out the front suspension adjustment. Here, you can see on forks. The left hand side is for compression. Here clearly likha gaya hai, this is for compression. Just twist it clockwise or anti-clockwise the way you want it. But you will have to remember the number of times you 
यू नो ट्विस्ट एंड यू नो मेक दैट क्लिक यहाँ पे दिस साइड इज फॉर रीबाउंड इट इज वेरी क्लियरली रिटर्न रीबाउंड ओवर हेयर सो अगेन यू हैव टू रिमेंबर वॉट सेटिंग यू आर एट वन ट्रिक विद दिस बाइक इज दैट जब आप ये सीट ओपन अप कर लोगे यहाँ पे चेक इट आउट यू हैव दईडियल सेटिंग मैं हेयर सो फॉर कम्फर्ट फॉर बेसिक सेटिंग एंड फॉर स्पोर्ट एंड विथ मैक्स पे लोड आपको फ्रंट फोक और रियर शॉक की जो बेस सेटिंग है the ideal setting it is mentioned over here very clearly ye jo suspension setup tune kiya gaya hai it is for a weight range of 75 to 90 kg so it will suit most of the riders and you know what the tire pressure setting is for standard riding for solo riding this bike recommends 29 29 at the front and at the back but when you are off roading of course you can drop the tire pressure so that you get better grip from these tires full led lighting aapko milti hai you know that You get a color TFT speedometer cluster. You know that. उसमें आपको audio के controls मिलते हैं You know that. You get turn by turn navigation as well, thanks to a third party application, not KTM India's application. Most of you don't know that, but it is available. Then you have an LED tail lamp and the entire kit remains the same. Crash guards जो हैं वो भी अभी भी same हैं Even though this bike is more adventure focused, उसमें कोई भी change नहीं किया गया है The only change which you will notice on this KTM 390 Adventure SW is the graphics kit on the side panel, and of course the spoke wheels and the adjustable suspension. Braking hardware में भी कोई changes नहीं किए गए हैं. It is still very confidence inspiring. Grab it and you will come to a safe and predictable stop. No drama, no tantrums, and the tires also back you up. Of course you can switch off ABS at the rear wheel. so that you can slide around if you want and that will also give you more confidence jab aap is bike ko off roading karte samay chala lete ho now if you want to get some air time ye bike jo hai ye suspension setup jo hai now because you can set it up as per your weight you can do more of that you can have more fun while doing that and when you land you know you don't have to worry about the suspension giving away and breaking down we have tried that today for 4 to 5 times and the suspension is still doing a fine job hame kahi bhi koi bhi four coil seal break hote hue nahi dikha hai we have not seen any leak from the front forks so that should give you some confidence agar aap zyada hardcore off roading karne wale ho there is nothing more that you can do beyond a jump so when you land that is the maximum impact unless of course you are really crazy and you want to try to break these forks जब आप ट्रेल्स पे इस बाइक को चला लेते हो या अगर आप इस बाइक को टारमैक पे चला लेते हो द हैंडलिंग कैरेक्टरिस्टिक इज स्टिल द सेम इट इज आइडेंटिकल एंड इट जस्ट मूव्स अराउंड द वे यू वांट इट इट इज अ पॉइंट एंड शूट काइंड ऑफ अ मोटरसाइकिल इट गिव्स यू वेरी गुड कॉन्फिडेंस सो दैट यू कैन हैव योर फेवरेट लाइन यू कैन अटैक दोज कॉर्नर एंड एग्जिट फास्ट एज वेल बिकॉज द सस्पेंशन इज गुड इट स्टेज प्लांटेड एंड ऑल्सो द इंजन ऑफकोर्स वी नो इट इट इज सुपर पंची द ग्रंट दैट यू गेट especially in the higher end of the power band it is really really good of course low end performance is not something that this motorcycle is good at so that continues so agar aapko sedate tarike se bike chalana pasand hai this might not be the ideal bike for you because the bike with this engine the nature is to be revved this is not to be ridden slow 4000 to 4500 rpm ke baad hi ye motor khush rehti hai that is the sweet spot if you ride under that the engine is going to hesitate a little it is going to tell you that you are doing something wrong with your right wrist and also if you want to just buy this bike as stock and if you want that convenience of no punctures you want that peace of mind up alloy wheels bhi alag se khareed sakte ho ye jo spoke wheels hain you can keep them as a spare set at home or you can just hang them in your house and make your house look cool and tell people visiting your home that you are into motorcycles ab ye jo suspension setup hai is motorcycle ka the front forks you can adjust on the fly bike chalate samay bhi aap ye sare changes kar sakte ho and you will feel the difference but at the back you will need a tool aapko ek screw driver ki zarurat hai so check it out yahan pe aapko wo screw diya gaya hai so that is how you will have to adjust the rebound and then you can set it up so this is something that you can't do on the fly of course aap ruk ke kahi pe bhi ek screw driver se very quickly ye setting bhi change kar sakte ho and of course you can also change the preload the bike looks the same the bike sounds the same and even the maintenance is going to be the same you are not going to spend a lot more on this variant for upkeep 
It is just that if you break the suspension, this one is going to be more expensive. If you want to save money later, you can buy the normal suspension setup, the non-adjustable suspension setup as well. This is going to be plug and play, but then you are going to make a compromise if you do that because then you will get no adjustment. So it is up to you. A very fine detail. If you check how much you have used suspension travel, come up close, let me show that to you. Here on the front fork, you have a red ring. Check it out. It is at the extreme end right now. And this thing, you can keep moving it up and down and then check out how much of that suspension travel you are using. It was at the extreme end right now because we went for some air time with this bike and it was a lot of fun, but it is scary as well if you are new to such kind of riding. So be careful, always wear proper riding gear, always learn from your experience. Don't look at someone else and go in all excited. Stay safe, you have only two legs and one motorcycle. On road and off road, this is definitely comfortable. We have shown that it is comfortable for two as well in our short format videos as well. So do check that out as well. Subscribe to the Shifting Guest channel on YouTube, of course, and even on Instagram. Now you will notice that there is nothing new except for those parts. And that is the only thing that we have to talk about in this particular video. Aap hume comments mein zarur bataiye kya hai aap ki rai is KTM 390 Adventure spoked wheel with fully adjustable suspension variant ke baare mein. Do you think this is now perfect for you? There was a lot of hue and cry about not getting these adjustable forks when the bike was launched. People were demanding spoked wheels. But now, is that going to translate into sales? Time will tell. Are those keyboard warriors going to go ahead and buy this bike? Time will tell. But for me, as an existing owner of the KTM 390 Adventure, let me tell you, I am very pleased with the suspension setup. I am going to upgrade to these front forks and also to this rear shock as soon as this is available in the stores at KTM service centers. You can expect that this suspension setup will cost you somewhere between 30 to 35,000 rupees plus and minus the labor cost but that is a worthy upgrade. Teen saal ke baad jab main is bike pe ye sare changes kar lunga it is going to feel a lot different and definitely this bike will be good enough to stay with me for a few more years to come and there is not too much of performance that I expect from a motorcycle here out on the Indian streets.